Hey friends, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna to share with you three delicious recipes featuring butternut squash. I'm an ambassador for Manitoba Harvest and they just came out with a new product, their Hemp Heart Toppers. Ta-da! These are amazing. I'm really excited to share them with you guys. So these new toppers are really amazing. They're essentially a blend of their traditional hemp hearts, hemp pro fiber, which is hemp powder, and also organic spices. They have four new delicious flavors. They have coconut cacao, onion, garlic, and rosemary, maple and cinnamon, and chipotle, onion, and garlic. And I'll be using three of these flavors in my recipes today. First, we'll be making butternut squash bruschetta featuring maple and cinnamon toppers. Then we'll be making butternut squash coconut soup with toasted hazelnuts featuring the chipotle, onion, and garlic toppers. And then last, I'm sharing with you how to make butternut squash and kale salad featuring the onion, garlic, and rosemary toppers. So without further ado, let's get to our recipes. All three recipes today use butternut squash roasted the exact same way. So here's how you make it. Preheat your oven to 425 degrees Fahrenheit. Then with a sharp knife, cut the butternut squash in half and remove the ends. Carefully remove the skin of the squash by cutting down along the sides. Cut the flesh in half and remove any seeds with a large spoon. Finally, chop the butternut squash into small cubes about one inch in size. Coat the squash cubes with one tablespoon of coconut oil and then place on a baking sheet and roast in the oven for 15 to 20 minutes. To make the butternut squash bruschetta, you will need butternut squash, coconut oil, French bread, a green apple, and Manitoba Harvest maple cinnamon toppers. While the squash is roasting, cut half inch slices from your French bread and toast. Next, dice your green apple. When the squash is finished roasting, blend on high until smooth. Lay out each piece of toasted bread and top with squash, green apple, and Manitoba Harvest maple cinnamon toppers. Enjoy! To make the butternut squash coconut soup, you will need butternut squash, coconut oil, hazelnuts, coconut milk, sea salt, and Manitoba Harvest chipotle onion and garlic toppers. While the squash is roasting, add hazelnuts to a stovetop pan on medium heat and toast for three to five minutes, watching and stirring frequently to prevent burning. When the squash is cooked, add one can of light coconut milk and a half a teaspoon of sea salt and blend until smooth. Serve topped with a drizzle of coconut milk, toasted hazelnuts, and Manitoba Harvest chipotle onion and garlic toppers. To make the butternut squash and kale salad, you will need butternut squash, coconut oil, kale, olive oil, lemon juice, pecan, sea salt, and Manitoba Harvest, onion, garlic, and rosemary toppers. While the squash is roasting, wash, dry, devein, and chop the kale. In a large bowl, add the kale, olive oil, lemon juice, and sea salt, and massage everything together. When your squash has finished roasting, let cool for 10 to 15 minutes. Serve the kale salad topped with pecans, roasted squash, and Manitoba Harvest onion, garlic, and rosemary toppers. So I hope you guys are really excited about these recipes and also these new amazing toppers. Nutritionally, they're fantastic. They have 10 grams of protein, four grams of fiber and 10 grams of omega-3 and omega-6 per serving. And a serving is 35 grams or four tablespoons. And obviously they have so many delicious flavors, so you guys can get really creative in the kitchen and sprinkle these on so many yummy recipes. For more information on today's recipe, you can head on over to our website, healthygrocerygirl.com. There's always a link below in the video description box. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you for subscribing to our channel. I love you guys and I will see you in the next video.